Hello. Hey, Calvin. Yeah. How's it going, man? Good. Hey, did I catch you at a bad time? I'm calling about 221 Twin Creek Drive. No, nah, you are. Right. Cool. I think you uh, submitted a web form on our website that you're looking to sell it. Yeah. Yeah, awesome, man. Um, can you tell me a little bit about the property? It's a, uh, it's a mobile home. It's on the permanent foundation. Uh, on like, I think it's about four tenths of an acre of land. It's got a private fence. Put a new roof on it. It needs some floor work and one of the bathrooms. Uh, it needs a fresh coat of paint. It needs a little bit of work. I'm, I'm the owner. It's paid for. And I live there now, but I'm looking to relocate and uh, try to buy something a little bigger. A little bit bigger. You want to upsize? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm pulling it up right now. While I pull it up, um, are you are you the only owner? Is there someone else that we should no, be talking I'm the, to? I'm the, I'm the only one. All right. Okay. So um, I got it. I got it right here. Pulling up on Zillow. So you you actually own the mobile home. Do you own the land on it as well? Yeah. Okay. So you own both. You own you own the mobile home and you own the land. Yes. All right. One second, let me, let me pull it up here. I'm not getting much data on Zillow, so I'm going to use some of my other software. Excuse me. your day going so far? I uh, just, just got in. We uh, we're in a landscape business and a tree removal business. And it's, <laughs> I'm glad to be done today. I'm, I'm tired. Yeah, you had a long day? Yeah. Yeah. I just, um, one of my sellers today was a landscaper. And, yeah. um, yeah, he, and so he did landscaping for his realtor. He had a buddy he did landscaping for, um, that guy was a realtor. And then when my seller had to sell his house, he used that realtor to sell and yeah. the realtor ended up taking advantage of him and he locked up his house for two years. It was a, wow. yeah, that I'm trying to help sense. him. Yeah. Cause, cause what I do is I buy these houses in cash. Right. And so yeah. We don't use realtors. We don't use agents. We don't use anyone like that. It's just you know man to man, right? I'm a I'm a private investor, um, okay. and and so like that website like that you filled out, I go and like that's a third party company, and I pay them for to the ability to talk to you on the phone, right? So okay. you're you're dealing directly with the guy who who actually buys these in cash. Um, right. So yeah, I, I'm looking this up. I'm looking up your house. Um, what were you hoping to get for this? Well, I, I really, I, I just, this is just the start of this. I don't, I don't really know, man. I, yeah. I'm, I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of torn between selling it and keeping it, but you know, I don't, I don't need two homes. I raised five children in the house mm. and they're, they're gone all but two of them now. So I, uh, I'm just ready to move from there and I found another place. So I, uh, I don't know. I mean, the market is hot right here now, even on something that needs work. So I'm thinking probably 60. Mm. 60,000. Yeah. <laughs> the way you said that, that didn't sound too good. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> so, well, so um, Calvin, right? Yeah. Yeah, man. So like, I, you know, it's, it's, universe works in mysterious ways. So like whether or not I buy this house, like let's chat for a little bit here. Um, maybe okay. we strike a deal, maybe we don't, but at least yeah. I want to point you in the right direction because you sound a little right. like you're not really sure what you want to do. And I've been doing this business for a long time. So, um, you know, it sounds like your kids, uh, you're kind of like an empty nester and like your kids, you know, you, you know, yeah. you, um, you, you raised five kids in the house and they, they all left. They, uh, went and built their own nests yeah 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 uh, so I'll, I'll, I'll put two of them two of them still with me they're still with you oh, how old are they they're uh they'll be four let's see no they'll be 15 this december they're twins that's the last two i got left okay so they're they're in high school now yeah so they're gonna be oh, probably yeah. they're gonna be going to college in a couple of years um or, or or at least maybe entering the workforce yeah after high school yeah, yeah. That's right. so um you want to you know um, you got to so that second property. Did you, did you end up buying it or are you looking at one that you like? No, nah, I've already bought it. 
you've already bought it, but you don't live there. You live here in this mobile home. Yeah. Got it. At, at, the, at, the, at the time being, yeah. At the time being, and you're planning on moving no matter what, right? Because you already bought it, so you probably bought it to move into, yeah? Yeah. All right. Yeah. So let's see here. So working with me, what I like to do is I like to pay uh, cash. I, I cut out the middleman so I can get you a bit of a better deal. So there's no realtor, there's no fees, any of that crap. I pay all that. Um, yeah. This is it's just a little bit hard to get. Can I put you on hold? Let me let me ask my senior partner just uh, to take a look at this. I mean, do you, you have a couple minutes, right? I'm not taking up uh, yeah. interrupting. Uh, Man, I'm sitting in under the shade tree. <laughs> <laughs> I got plenty of time. Okay, cool. Dope, man. All right, let me let me just put you on hold. Let me talk to my senior partner. He's awesome. His name is RJ. Uh, we call him the Viking Wizard here at the office. So let me let me okay. get, let me just talk to him. Uh, Bro. What's up? Help. Hold that. Hold that. Where'd you go? I didn't hear you. You can't hear me? Yeah, what'd you say? You sound like you're underwater. Oh, really? Hold on. Can you hear me now? Yep. Yep, go ahead. Um, so how do I comp this? It's a, um, it's like a mobile home. So I don't really buy these. What's so. the name? Um, Calvin let's... McBride. Right. It's mobile with foundation and land though, right? Mm -hmm. So it's like a mobile home, but it's like a ranch, just like a, cr a crappy ranch. Pretty much. Liam, does it say own land? Or he wants sixty. He wants sixty, and so, um, love Francis right here next to me. She's comping this, and she's saying that a similar one sold for eighty-seven thousand. So let's. Let me confirm how he owns it free and clear, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So he just threw the finance. 60 out there, like whatever. He just threw the sixty. I don't know. How, how well, let's yeah, go let's sell the finance and let's just go base off the rent rate. <clears throat> is it a mobile home or is it a manufactured home? You let me ask him. Yeah. Hey, Calvin. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Is it a mobile home or is it a manufactured home? It doesn't have what? Sorry, what was that? Axles. It does not. It does not. So is it? Has it been like affixed to the ground, or is it not affixed? Yes, it's got a permanent. It's on a permanent foundation. You know, brick foundation with. It, there's no axles on it, so it's it's fixed. Got it. So, so it is a manufacturer. And how many bed and baths does it have? It's three bedrooms and two baths. All right, give me one second, all right? I'm just writing this down, taking this. My guy. I saw you making hand gestures. Yeah, yeah. Let's just get them to seller finance it um, so we can cash flow it and, and keep it as a rental. Seller finance it at 60? Well, in that, oh, in, in that, in that way y'all do, you know, I, your price, my terms, right? Yes, yes. Uh, what's a good cash price, do you think? 40? Um, 18. Really? Yeah, anchor the shit out of them, and then you get your seller finance. Let's do it. He already he already negotiated you off of the sixty. He said, "Oh, that didn't sound good," so he'll take fifty or forty-five. Now, yeah. is RJ being competitive or is he being helpful? <laughs> We're JVing on this. We're JVing on this. <laughs> so. I, I would. That's uh, honestly what I would do. I'd say, look, listen, man, cash. I'm probably gonna need to be like eighteen to twenty, but I could probably do like forty-five to fifty seller finance as long as we can come in on the the correct monthly price. Let's do it. I love this. This is why RJ is the best. He knows what he's doing. All right. Hey, okay. I just ran the numbers. You ready? Yeah. So for a cash sale, because of the condition it's in, because it needs a lot of work and it's not really a home home, it's a manufactured home, we're going to be somewhere in the 15 to 20 range for cash. 15 to 20? Yeah. That's for, that's for everything? That's for, that's the cash. If you wanted to liquidate this in cash. Yeah. But. Uh, I, I wouldn't be able to do that at all, man. I know, I know. That's, I, I mean, I got, I, got, I got that in it. You got that in it, right? 
So what what I do is since I'm I'm an investor, I'm a private investor, I can actually do more money if you give me terms. Terms? Yeah. So say you let me make payments to you, right? And I got a payment structure with you. And we, we use a title company to make that whole thing legit. Yeah. And um, I make payments. Now I can go in and use my cash to improve the property and put a tenant in there. Yeah. And you essentially become the bank. And we, we, we can actually pay you a lot more money that way because now I got a payment structure and I can, I can make a little bit of profit every month by putting my cash in there, repairing the property, putting a tenant in there and collecting that monthly rent. Right. Is that something right. that that interests you? Does that get you a little bit more excited to maybe make a little bit more money on this? No, nah, not really. Not really. No. What What are you looking for? What are you hoping to accomplish? Not sure. You want to sell this at sixty? I mean, that, yeah. I mean, it, it, right here where I'm at, look, it, 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 it's, it's right here right now. We're selling. People, people are fighting to buy houses where I'm at right now. They're paying fifteen, twenty, thirty thousand dollars over asking price for for a couple of homes, uh, a two hundred fifty thousand dollar house here now. Uh, three years ago, they're selling for three twenty five, three fifty now. And they're and they're 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 paying over asking price ten, fifteen, twenty, sometimes thirty thousand dollars just to get home. So no, I, I wouldn't be interested in that at all. Now, I mean, I can I can do what you're trying to do now. I can do that myself. Yeah, I'm, go get a tenant in there. I'm just liquidate it and just get it out of the way. So you're looking um, you're looking for a cash offer. You're looking you're not interested in taking payments or anything like that. Even if somebody came in and made you a down payment and yeah, gave you some interest on it. I don't really need that. I mean, yeah, I'm just I'm looking to just get rid of it. I don't I don't, I don't really want to upkeep two properties, you know. But I mean. I mean, I could. I mean, I can move one of my children in it, you know, clean it up or, you know, fix it. And uh, I can move one of them in it. But no, I'm not really interested in that at all. Yeah. Yeah. That, I respect that, Calvin. I, yeah. I totally get that. And I just, yeah. I'm a little curious about something. You said you'd have to upkeep two properties. So um, if we did something like this, there would be no upkeep. You'd be Bank of Calvin. And I, I would be right. making payments to you as if you were the bank. So when okay. a to, when well, a do toilet, you, do you have something in mind? Do you have some kind of a payment in mind? Yeah, oh, it, it's something. Okay. Yeah, I'm thinking right. So yeah. I'm thinking of making a monthly payment to you. Uh, I could do something. I can do something a lot closer to the 40s if uh -huh. we do something like this, and I'd make a down payment to you. I would uh -huh. then improve the property, and I'd make monthly payments to you. Uh -huh. And I can even give you a little bit of an interest rate. So you make money on top of your money. Okay. Well, um, what, we can, we can, can you put some numbers together? Yeah, I sure can. We so can right this. let me, um, what are you doing today? Um, I'm actually right now, I'm not, I'm not doing anything right now, but I have something to do here in about the next 30 or 45 minutes. Uh, actually, we had a truck to tear up today, so we got a. I'm just taking a break right now. I'm, I'm fixing to get sucky shit. <laughs> I got. I got to go work on the truck here in just a little bit. But yeah, so I mean, I'm having time. I, you can call back anytime. It's fine. Yeah, but I want to. I want to just put something just out there so you can yeah. let it marinate. Like we don't have to make a decision today, but okay. we can let something marinate. Um, give me just. Just let me put you on hold for another two minutes. Let me just put some numbers together. Okay. Well, this year, the number that I would anchor to would be the total interest paid over 15 years, 16,000, because that sounds good no matter what. Yeah, do you see what I got here? This is 50,000 at 4% interest over 15 years, so it's 369 a month. But like Liam said, you can tell them, well, really, we're paying you 66,000, so we're paying you more. Than what you even asked. Oh, this is dope. This is dope. Let's do it. Hey, Calvin. Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah. All right, cool. So I actually ran it through my mortgage calculator 
And so I'm just throwing this out there. Um, this is actually looking very, very promising. Um, if I bought it at, let's say I, I did it even more, I can actually pay up to $50,000 uh -huh. on seller finance. And if I gave you a 4% interest rate, which is something I can do, yeah. uh, what those payments look like is a little bit under 400 a month. And if right. we do it a 15 year note, the total amount of payments you're going to get is going to total to $66,571. With a down payment of what? I was looking here to make a down payment, uh, something like $5,000 down. Oh, okay. You, you, uh, you don't sound excited with the $5,000 down payment. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> what 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 kind of what kind of down payment were you open for? I don't know. Uh, a little bit more than that. What, 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 you tell me what 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 would get you curious about this? What would get you excited? You're fishing, man. What was you're, that? You're fishing. I'm. Well, I want to know. I told you what I wanted to give you, but I want to know what you, you wanted. Me, you tell me what you can do, and I'll tell you if I can do it or not. You're, you're the bank, right? So when I go and get a loan from the bank, they tell me the, the loan terms, right? So what 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 you're you're in charge. You tell me what you want. And I, I go back and I see if this makes sense from a cash perspective. Because you got to remember, man, I got to go fix up the property. I got to spend my cash. I got to hire some local contractors. Maybe I can hire you to do the landscaping. I'd love to do that. Um, but I got to hire some people to, to fix this house up and put it in red ready condition, right? Right. So what 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 would be a nice down payment? Which you go, yeah, yeah. If he made this down, I would be happy. So the the, the terms that you were talking about, Wally, are you talking about um, sixty? What do you say, sixty six over, and with a five thousand dollar down payment over fifteen years at about four hundred dollars a month? Yeah, just about. So the purchase price would be fifty thousand, but because I'm giving you interest, you get about sixty eight thousand over the course of the loan. So you'd be selling this for more than you're asking for. Yeah. Okay. Well, you said I can marinate on that. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So I want you to think about a down payment um, that okay. that makes sense to you, all right? Now, this number that you called me from is 5712744087. That's yeah. your number? Yeah, that's my direct line. Okay. And... Uh, let's say this, like before I let you go, let's say you, you think about it, you marinate on it and you, you like the idea. How uh, soon would you be ready to move on this? Uh, I mean, as quick as you wanted to move. Oh, that's... I mean, I'm, I can go, I can go and I can have my stuff out of there in two days. Okay. Like, like, cause, cause yeah, what I'm I, trying to I, do here. Yeah, right, I'm like, very flexible as far as that's concerned. I mean, I can, I can go because the other place is ready. All I got to do is just go move in. How much would you think I would need to spend on fixing this property up? Because that that's part of my equation, right? Because I'm assuming I'm going to need a certain amount of money, right? Yeah. Um, you know, I, I, most of it is just cosmetic. There's some sheetrock work to be done on the inside. Okay, it needs it needs a fresh coat of paint which is not that much. Um, I put hardwood floors in it. That, like I said, one of the bathroom floors, I had a leak in the sink and the floor is, the floor, it needs to be torn up and put new new plywood down in that in that bathroom, which is, is not a huge call. So I'm saying to get the property up, I was going to say, I was gonna say uh, less than $5,000. If if that much, it depends on how 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 a, how, uh, how specific you wanted to do things. I mean, you got sheetrock, uh, you got some some paint, the flooring, maybe a new vanity in the master bathroom. But other than that, it's it's good. I would I would I would want to make it pretty nice because like you know you would be my lender here right so it's in both of our best interests to like if I if I spent that extra money maybe I spend you know ten or twelve you know make yeah. it make it really nice and and so we can charge yeah. a little bit more for rent you know what I mean yeah. so like that asset 
that that you would be lending on, right? Because you would be it'd be Bank of Calvin. It's in it's in really your best interest to make that asset really good, right? So I'm thinking here I spend about maybe like closer to 15 just to make this really nice. And, and that's kind of where I'm at, where I was thinking, okay, I'll be all in 20,000 out of that 60,000. I give you 5,000 uh, in your pocket. I'd spend 15 on the property and then I'll be paying all the closing costs because we're going to be using a title company and they're going to be making sure everything's legit. And we're going to be using them to make sure that you have a, um, you own the mortgage on that house. So I have to pay them. So adding those costs up, that's really where I got the 5,000. Well, you know, I never really thought about it in those terms of way it, that you're, I was just thinking about just selling it straight out. But you know, that, 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 that may be something that I might be interested in, but I, to be honest with you right now, something has just come up and I'm not trying to put you off, man. I'm no, I know. I know. I, you, you told me, you told me you're, you're going to have something come up. So why don't, why don't I call you back? And why don't you think about that down payment? Because I think that's just that last little bit, and we can get this thing squared away. Yeah. All right. Um, and, I, and I'll and I'll think about that. And um, I got. Do you want me to call you back on this number? Yeah, this is my direct sell. You can also text me here too. All right, brother. Okay. All right. I, I'll do that. Just uh, I won't leave long. Maybe maybe uh, tomorrow. Yeah, I just need to know what you want down, so I can start calculating how much I'm going to spend to fix this property up. Okay. All right. That'll work. All right. Later. All right. All right. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. Bye.